Hey guys, Donnie here, and I'm at the park with the SP700 from Snaptain. I'm gonna go take this out for the first initial flight and see how well this does. Maybe test out some of the functions. I apologize for the loud noise, but they're doing construction over there on the other side and building some uh, some kind of building over there. So you're gonna hear a lot of that uh, construction sound. So uh, nothing I could do about it, but this is the only park I could fly at the moment. So, all right guys, let me get this thing fired up and I'll be right back. All right, you guys, I'm gonna go ahead and plug in the battery. Make sure you lock it. It's locked. I'm gonna let it bind here. Okay, it's bound. There's the telemetry on there. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, find the network here. When you hear those two beeps, that means it's ready to go ahead and calibrate. But I'm gonna go and uh, find Snaptain here. There's Snaptain. Make sure that connects. Okay, it's connected. I'm gonna go over to uh, Snaptain Echo. Let's get on the app here. Okay. We are connected to Wi-Fi FPV. I'm gonna go ahead and do the sequence here. I'm gonna go ahead and do counterclockwise. Lights start flashing here. All right. Okay, they went solid red and solid green, so we're good. Okay. We have seven satellites, you guys, so seven satellites so we should be good to go strong signal i'm gonna go ahead and wait for one more there we go there's eight i'm going to uh, start the recording recording says it started and i don't see there it is it's recording on top okay you guys let's calibrate it okay calibrating the drone now we should be able to fire up Let's see here, there we go. We're in GPS mode, so seems pretty solid and quiet. Let me bring it down a little bit here. Yeah, that thing is super solid right now. Looks good. All right, let's go ahead and take this thing for a little flight here. See if my telemetry came up or not here, one meter up. Let's go ahead and take her out a little bit. So far, telemetry is working. Let's go ahead and take it for a little flight here. I'm gonna just go forward for a little bit here. We're up about 20, 30. Let's go up to about 50 meters. Okay, we're up at 55 meters. I'm gonna go out a bit here. And so far so good. I want to stop because I see the road there. I don't want to go any further, so I'm going to go ahead and try the return to home. See if I can get this thing to return to home here. Here it comes. Now this one don't beep at all when it returns to home you guys so be aware of that and i've already lost uh, wi-fi contact it says disconnected but i see the drone coming back here it comes you guys can't believe i already lost contact already came back sideways that's kind of strange and it still froze up but it did come back wait for it to come down here here it comes coming down so return to home will not beep so remember that I got Wi-Fi feedback again and I probably I'm not too sure how far I went out it stopped uh, right when I went to go look down then I lost connection 
so I'll have to see if my screen recorder is working on my phone and go back and look. But here it comes. It's kind of strange coming back uh, sideways like that. It's weird. It's not facing the direction I took off. It's actually facing... Which way is that facing? It looks like it's facing... Uh, it is facing towards me okay and it is quite a bit off i'm gonna go ahead and cancel it out let's cancel that out it's it's off and you can see it's facing towards me but sideways and i went out there i don't know i think that's probably maybe 300 meters i know when i'm at that uh at that uh, little picnic spot there uh the grass area is about 150 meters so yeah very strange Still recording though. Let me just take it up and try to take a few aerial fo photos here. Take it up a little bit here. About 40, 50, 60, 70. It's beeping at me and we are going to leave it at. 102 all right i'm gonna look around for a minute still got three quarters of battery let's pan around a little bit here take a little glimpse out here the city oh my phone just kicked on i forgot to shut off of this hold on there we go left my surrey on darn it all right let's pan around here Starting to beep on me here. It says I got full. All right, let me go ahead and stop the recording. Okay, I'm gonna stop recording, switch the camera, and take a snapshot here. There should be one. It says successful. another one successful let me flip it around here see if you guys could see this on here hopefully my screen recording is working and one more facing towards the park and the fields out there okay gonna switch it back okay gonna start recording again Gonna start bringing it down and kind of out a little bit so I'm not getting any prop wash here. Let me slow down because these things are kind of fast. So it is coming down 50, 60 meters out, 65. Let me go ahead and stop right there for a minute. Keep bringing it down. We're 100 meters out hitting a little bit of prop wash here looks like I got something on the on the screen that's what that little dot is so let's go ahead and bring it down some more okay if someone's walking probably wondering what that sound is okay I'm gonna go out again there is 150 Okay, there's 200 right there. So 200, it stops. Let me go ahead and bring it back, guys. Let me bring it back. It's coming back. Let's try another return to home here. And then I got about three quarters of battery. We'll try some of the other functions. So just over 200 meters, 226 meters, I lose Wi-Fi FPV, but still have plenty of uh, control. So here we are, did a little better this time. Still a little crooked on facing back and it still is quite a bit off from the landing pad. So let's see, it's gonna wait a second here and then start dropping down. Here it comes. So it is quite a bit off. Let 
not right on the money as I expected. It's like it's following the controller, you know what I mean? And it's uh, it's actually facing away from me this time. I'm gonna cancel this out. So um, it's actually facing away from me. Last time it came back facing that way with the camera this way. So, all right, let me see if I can test out some other functions here. Let me go back a little bit. I'm gonna go to the side here, so. All right, let's check out uh, the follow me here. See if I get it to start following me. Looks like it's off a bit here. It's following me off to the side there. It's like it's not lining up here, but it is following me, you guys. Just looks like it's following me. It's not completely centered. All right, so follow me is working. All right, let me stop that. Okay, let's see if I can set up like a uh, point of interest. Here's the circle me. Let me get out here a little bit. All right, let me get right here. Let's try a circle me. Okay, it's gonna start and it's gonna work its way around you guys. And it's not recording right now. You have to record each time you start these uh, functions, you guys. I didn't realize that. So the, so the follow me wasn't recording. Yeah, the follow me was not recording, you guys. So I'll have to try that again and look at the video here. All right, I guess it's gonna keep going until I stop it. All right, I'm gonna stop it. All right, let's stop recording. I'm gonna go and I'm gonna shut off my, I'm gonna put my screen on airplane mode because I'm getting, uh, I'm getting stuff coming in. Uh, let me go on airplane mode and see if I can keep this still going here. Airplane mode, let's turn on Wi-Fi again and connect. So it'll just be a second, you guys. You can see it still stays connected, so you don't have to worry about it flying off. All right, let me get back over here and uh, get to the app. Okay, we're back going. So I put on airplane mode, turn the Wi-Fi back on, so it's just focusing on that, and I'm not getting everybody else's... Uh, I won't get calls through or people from Facebook and stuff like that. So let's go ahead and do the follow me again. I'm going to turn it a little bit over to the its right-hand side and see if it will line up with me this time. That still goes to its left a little, but I'm going to go ahead and start recording. Let's try this again. I'll start walking this way here. Apologize, my back is not in good shape, you guys. <laughs> So it is following me. Let's see if it can follow me in the shade here. See if it still picks me up or if it loses me. It should pick me up because I think it's using the, the GPS and the controller. So yeah, that's what it's doing because you don't have to outline or nothing. So that means it's using the GPS in there. So let me go ahead and shut that off. The battery's getting low. All right, so it's doing low battery already. So I didn't even get to do a I didn't even get to do a point of interest, you guys. So we'll have to do that another time because I only have one battery. So I have to see how long we got out of that battery. Because um, once that's going, you sh you, I don't believe you could do point of interest anymore. No, nope, it's not going to do it. And it's trying to... That one's not point of interest. What that is, is if you point it in the direction you want, you press this and it will just follow that it'll just uh, it's doing return to home let's just forget it it's gonna try to land so I'll do that another time you guys let's just see how long we get out of this battery and uh, I'm gonna put it in uh, altitude hold go for a little sport fly for a minute and it's not gonna be as fast as it normally is because the battery is low but it does scoop pretty good in altitude hold and you can see it's an altitude hold see how it still floats if you click this back over it'll lock right back in 
So I'm gonna lock that in. I'm gonna see if it has a geo fencing. Let me go out a bit here. I'm at 16. Nope, it still goes out, so. So it does still go back out when it's uh, on low battery, so. See if we can see the American flag here. There's the American flag. To see if this thing is going to come back to me or not. We are at two bars. I'm just going to kind of take it slow over here, run it around a little bit. I just kind of want to see what this battery, see if we get close to that 18 minutes. Two bars and it's still flying around. So the war low warning light is on rather early but i guess that's good if you're quite a ways out because i have a feeling this one will go more than 500 meters but you're going to lose the transmission and the only way to keep that transmission uh there's mods to do you guys you can get a wi-fi repeater you could connect a wi-fi repeater to uh the controller here uh, with the power pack and you can boost that signal and get a lot further but then you're going to start going to where you're going to lose line of sight so about 500 meters three to 500 meters i can still see it but it's just a dot so you really don't want to go any further than that anyways and the range on this is 500 meters and it's supposed to be 400 meters of transmission or um, wi-fi signal but uh, i'm getting i'm getting uh only 227 i believe i think it said 227 i'll have to look back but it's still flying around I just want to see what it does when it gets uh, too low here. Now the flag's flying high there. See if we can see the flag again. Oh, here we go. It's returning to home. So now I can't control it. It's coming back, you guys. So I'll have a time for you once this gets landed. So it just comes straight back. It didn't even turn around or nothing. So here it comes. It'll just be a minute. It finds its bearings and it'll come back down. You can see the rear uh, lights are flashing quite a bit because the battery's low. So there we go, guys. All right, let me shut that control off. Let me make sure I shut the video off here. Video's off, so don't forget that. And there we go. All right. So far, so good, guys. The Snaptane uh, SP700. It's a pretty cool little drone. I can't wait to see the video footage. I'll add that uh, on the screen when it's flying. Uh, if I did get a screen recording, I'll definitely add that on one of the sides as well. Um, and see if I could throw some Wi-Fi uh, recording feed on there as well so that way you guys could see a little bit of everything so uh, the only thing I didn't get to try out was the point of interest you know um, I'll have to do that another time I ran out of battery so um, definitely get two batteries if you can you know if I have a link for an extra battery I'll put it down in the description same with the, dr the drone here guys so all right, I appreciate you guys watching. Uh, if you're new to the channel, definitely hit that like and subscribe button. Uh, definitely hit the notifications because uh, you never know what's coming up next and what's new out on the market that I'm reviewing. So, all right, Snaptain, thanks for sending this out, you guys. Like always, God bless, cheers, and happy flying.